and welcome to this power duration two minute tutorial on modeled functional threshold power or MFTP. MFTP can be found in the hero bar of any selected athlete. It's on the right hand side with the other power duration metrics. MFTP can be used in both charts and reports within dashboards of WKO5. MFTP is the model derived highest power a rider can maintain in a quasi steady state without fatiguing. Units are typically in watts or watts per kilogram. We measure MFTP by utilization of the power duration model and MFTP is a simple output of that model. Model defined FTP well, it's very similar to your maximal lactate steady state and your lactate threshold. There's a lot of discussion that can go on about this FTP threshold, lactate threshold, maximal lactate steady state. There are slight differences in all of them, obviously, but the reality is they generally track the same, meaning if your modeled FTP or your FTP goes up and you went into a lab and have been consistently testing your MLSS, that would also probably go up and they would go up in a generally similar relationship, meaning if one goes up 5%, the other would go up about 5%. So there's a relationship there that even though there's a lot of discussion on which one we should use, FTP is the easiest one to utilize and it tends to track with the others. MFT is the power you can approximately sustain for an hour. Often we hear this discussion. Um, it gets over correlated with one hour, but the reality is ranges from 35 to 70 minutes at FTP are possible. What does MFTP do? Well, as we know, it's a measurement of the maximal sustained aerobic energy or ability. Um, not anaerobic energy and contribution from the anaerobic side. It is the aerobic side. This often leads people to overestimate their FTP. What does it do in kind of racing? Well, FTP is the single biggest determinant of success in cycling events. Not the only one, obviously, but if you had one area, one thing you could focus on, focusing on raising your FTP would probably improve your results the best. We tend to use it in time trials is the core focus when we talk about FTP, but also things like longer climbs, longer efforts, all types of events are involved in it. For a range of modeled FTP, males, the average is about 296 watts, low is 246 watts or below, high is above 346 watts. Um, these are not weight adjusted, so the reality is uh, doing this by watts per kilogram um, might give you deeper insight. And females, the average range is about 219 watts, with 191 being low and above 247 being high. Thank you.